Alright, welcome back to another video. Today uh, we are starting up a brand new series here on the channel. You guys know CTR is done right now. I am not really uploading any CTR videos, but we are branching out a little bit starting off with uh, Crash 1, 2 and 3. More known as the Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. We are starting up a series where we play through the first, the second and the third um, Crash Bandicoot game. This will not be a full let's play. I'm gonna have like these uh, highlight moments. Uh, otherwise the videos will get way too long. Anyway, the music man, the music already. Mm, oh, absolutely love it. We'll just jump straight into it. I think I have played this before, but I'm not too sure if I've beaten it. Uh, fully. So we'll just uh, we'll just start with Crash Bandicoot One. We'll have a new game. Dr. Cortex, we haven't determined the cause. Oh, I actually forgot. <laughs> there are cutscenes in this, this one. Bandicoot will be my general. He will lead my Cortex commandos to world domination. This time, I shall reign triumphant. <laughs> This is how Crash Bandicoot is created. We are closer than ever before. Quickly, into the vortex. <laughs> Dr. Cortex, the vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> it's gonna go wrong. Failure again. Uh-oh. Oh my god. <laughs> Prepare the female oh, Tana. <laughs> She's the next victim. Okay, so Cortex basically um, experimented on bandicoots and Crash Bandicoot was one of them. And uh, hey, uh, and Sanity Beach, let's go. Oh my god, this is... It's been a hot minute since I've played uh, this game, for sure. Now, I am not gonna go for like 100% in this game. I'm gonna try and get as many 100% levels here as possible, but um, it's not my main goal to actually go for, uh, go for 100%. Now, as you guys know, uh, I am super, super bad at... Um, at platformers. Every single time I play like a Crash Bandicoot platformer game and I have played platformer games uh, before like I've played Crash 4, uh, Crash uh, Twin Sanity as well but I just oof I just absolutely suck and um, in Crash 1 here uh, I, th I think Crash 1 is the most difficult one right? I think it is. Oh no. Oh there's a box there. I hope I don't miss any boxes though. Which one? Uh, which freaking side do I go? Okay, so I didn't go. Oh! Oh my god. So I didn't go to this side. Oh, okay, so I need to go back. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's see. So I can do this. Oh. I'm a legend. Let's go. First try, baby. <laughs> Actually proud of myself. Bang! 100% completed. Level 1 is already done and dusted. I really like this screen over here as well. Um, where it says how many gems you got, how many keys, and then how many, um, how many boxes you completed? It's not gonna tell me how many boxes I completed? Okay then. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play... Um, till one of the boss fights uh, in every single episode. Uh, I think the first one, if I remember correctly, is Papu Papu. I'm not too sure how fast that one is, but um, my plan for this episode is just to play up to that boss fight. And every single episode I play till a boss fight until uh, I get through uh, the three main games here. So, level two, Jungle Rollers. Let's get right into it. Freak you, TNT crates! There we go. I still got like triple Aku Aku here, that's insane. No, that's not what I meant to do. Whew. Wait, we got a Tana, um, a Tana icon. Oh, 
It's already starting, bro. Stupid and silly mistakes. All right, let's just not fall in here anymore. Thank you. Good. Now, if you guys have any tips on uh, how to do Crash 1, um, or just any tips on uh, on these games in general, uh, you can always let me know down below in the comment section. I am not that good at these type of games, but I do want to uh, want to give it a try. Now, I don't know what this is. Is this like the gem route or something that you need to come back to the level to just get everything 100% here? Do you first need, need to get like the red gem or something? I actually don't know. Ooh, how do I do this? Oh my god, run, run! Oh, yes, good. It's, ve it's very weird that double jump is not pressing X twice, but you need to hold X. It's weird, because I think in Crash 4, you just have to press it twice. But in this game, it's not that. Oh, Tana Icon! There we go! Oh, these are the, these are the like, bonus stages I see, okay. So it looks like there's five, five crates we need to do in these bonus stages. Of course, yeah, of course the first one is gonna be pretty easy. And I get um, some lives as well. Uh, yeah, Cortex is gonna just carry her away, okay. Um, but these bonus stages will get more difficult um, when you uh, when you progress through, uh, through the game. Woo! Oh my god. Now, one hit and you can be just absolutely dead, man. One hit and you're done. Ah, oh, three crates, man. That's really annoying. Yeah, that that is that is just really annoying. I have to come back to this level um, once I get the gem. I think this is when. Okay, so they say how many boxes you miss, not ha not how many boxes you you got. You missed three boxes. That's uh, it's kind of annoying. Okay, next level here, and uh, you guys can let me know which of the older Crash games. Um, crash 1, 2, uh, two or 3, uh, do you prefer? Do you prefer the first one, or the second one, or the third one? Uh, you can always let me know down below in the comment section. Oh my god. Okay. We got triple Aku Akus. Get wrecked. All of you get wrecked. Oh! Could have been a death right there. No. I have to wait. I have to wait. I need that life. It's been a, a little too long since I've played, ooh, since I played these games, so I I couldn't really say to you uh, which um, which game I actually prefer. But uh, I think when I when I played these games like five years ago or something, um, I think I enjoyed Crash Three the most. I needed that turtle, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Oh my god, I'm... Um... There we go. Let's go. Now, I said I wasn't gonna go for like 100%, but... The completionist in me... Just wants to get as many boxes as possible, man. Especially when it's this early in the game! How do I... Okay. It's already starting to, uh, to get a little bit more difficult here. But I think that this this first world should be pretty much doable without stupid deaths here. But I already got two deaths. No, no. Ooh. Bonus stage. Is that the Tana? Yeah, there we go. Bonus stage incoming. Let's see if it's uh, actually a little bit more difficult this time. There's TNT crates. Okay, that should be doable. Uh, not sure how. Okay, I need to get rid of that. Bang. Oh. I did it again. I did it again. Oh my god, am I stupid or something? Wait, I missed eight boxes? I, I know why I missed eight boxes. Look at what's in front of me right now. Look at that. It's another gem route. So, I can't even... I can't even get all the boxes. That's so frustrating, man. All those deaths for nothing. Oh, this is one of the this is one of the Oh my god, I remember this one. This is also the level you play in like Uncharted 4, I think. Like there's there's a level in or like a moment in Uncharted 4 where you play uh, this level from the first crash game. 
and I absolutely loved that one. I, I kept replaying it till I actually got the high score, so I should remember how to play this one. Uh, I should remember the, the boxes and stuff, where they are. There we go. Gonna be in here. Let's get all of those. Let's try and get this level 400%, shall we? This should be doable. Let's follow these. Gonna be a box there. Box here. Oh my god. The boulder is getting closer, though. This actually kind of reminds me of a scene from um, Indiana Jones or something. Most likely it's based on that. Oh, let's go. Or Indiana Jones is actually based on this game. I think this game released a day before my birthday. Or on my birthday. I, I can't really like remember. The 8th of September 1996, man. Insane. Okay. Upstream, I see. A water level, kind of. This one's gonna... I need that Tana. I hate this. I actually forgot how weird the jumping mechanics are in this game. Like, you can you can misplace your jump so so easily uh, in this game. Like, okay, there's a shadow below crash. More gem root? What the heck? There's so many of them. But yeah, there is a shadow below crash, but it's not that visible. So it's actually oh, it's actually quite. Um, Where did we miss a ton of box, though? Okay, we got, um... <laughs> we got 11 out of 36 boxes. Um... Uh, Crash! Please survive this! Oh my god, he's getting spanked by boxes. Alright, here we have it. Papu Papu. Um, the first boss fight. I think there's Papu Papu in this one. There's, um... Ripperoo, there's Pinstripe, Cortex. Engine, maybe? I, I actually don't know. I actually don't remember. <laughs> and this is how long it's been since I've played um, this game. So, Papu Papu, let's beat his ass. Uh, there he is, sleeping on his throne. Oh boy. Okay. Hey, Papu. How you doing? Oh. Oh. No, I can't. What the? No. Wait, can I just... Oh! How do I... How do I do this? How do I do this? Hello? I need to... I need to jump on his head, right? Do I need to freaking Google this? How to... Defeat Papu Papu. <laughs> it's one of the, the the top searches as well. So pe people are struggling with this. Wait a second. This is this is not logical. You need to jump on his head while he's spinning. What? The, where is the logic in this one? Uh, now it's super easy. Uh, what? I, I I cannot believe this. I actually cannot believe this. Who made this? Who made this boss fight? Out of words, man. Out of words. Alright, and I think from this point on, uh, you can become Coco as well. Now, I'm gonna play through the full game as Crash. Um, I think there's uh, three more worlds uh, in this first uh, on this first island, and then we move on to the next one uh, in next video. I am super embarrassed that uh, I had to Google how to defeat Papu Papu, but you have to admit it's not logical that he's he's doing attacks. Usually, you just have to avoid the attacks until there's like a a moment you can you can strike, you know, but. In this first boss fight, you needed to strike while he was doing the attack. It's, I don't know. I, I don't know who designed it, but it's weird. It's super weird. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode of the series. Once again, let me know which Crash Bandicoot game is your favorite one. Crash 1, 2, 3, or 4. 
Of course, you also have like uh, Wrath of Cortex, Twin Sanity and all those other games. Just let me know which um, Crash game is your favorite. And uh, I can't wait to jump into, uh, into the next recording session because uh, playing Crash 1 and just playing the Crash platformer games is oddly satisfying for me. I don't know why, but it's just really, really satisfying to break all the boxes and to just jump on enemies' heads and stuff. It's just, mm, I like it. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please leave a like if you want to see more. Then subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video.